Admin PLC Smarty video. In this video, we show something about groups. Okay, we have a PLC project. In the program blocks, we have some function blocks and data blocks. To make it more organized, we can create by clicking on the program blocks and clicking then on the add new group, some groups in your program blocks. This means the, this is the group of the program blocks in your PLC project. For example, first group we named name main, <coughs> then for example motors, and then for example others. Now by marking the blocks and drag and drop it to the group we have these blocks in the group for example all blocks from main we drag and drop to the group main then motors we drag and drop to the group motors and other blocks we drag and drop to the others group and how you can see now it's more nice and more organized in your PLC project. I know if I want to go to the block which has something with the motors, I know I go to the motors group and here I choose the block, for example. <coughs> Same you can do for the PLC text, where we again create a new group, for example, with name inputs, outputs then group with the name motors and group with the name others and same like before you drag and drop for example for now inputs and outputs stack table and drag and drop to the inputs outputs group and same for the motors and others stack tables we drag and drop to the others group Oops, sorry. It's not possible to drag and drop and insert the default talk table to the <coughs> some group. Okay, how you can see this, I think it's more organized and more nice when you have it like that in your PLC project. It's more easy to find some some PLC block in your project. So thank you for watching this video and goodbye.